In this video, I will solve your doubts about how to use browser on Apple TV and whether or not it is possible to do this. In this video, I'm going to be discussing the possibility of browsing the web directly on your Apple TV and which methods you have available to do this. So first, if you try to browse through all of the options on your Apple TV, even though you can find various different applications, you can browse through different applications that you can download for your Apple TV, browse through movies, TV shows, so on, you won't be able to find a web browser natively available. Of course, the main workaround to this is going to be to go over to an iPhone or an iPad and choose the screen mirroring option. Then you open the web browser on that smartphone or the iPad and you choose the option to share the screen off your device with the Apple TV. But can you do this natively? Is there some sort of browser application that you can download directly on the Apple TV? Is this dependent on the model? Do you have to bypass certain options? Do you have to go into the settings? Well, the answer to the question in the title of this video is that the Apple TV does not have a built-in web browser. Because of this, unless you do heavy modifications in your Apple TV, you will not be able to use a web browser. It is unfortunate because it is a technology that should be implemented on most devices nowadays, but a lot of modern devices like a PlayStation 5, these Apple TVs models, and so on, do not have built-in web browsers. So accessing websites, browsing the web, and so on, cannot be done natively on the Apple TV. As I've said before, the main workaround that people like to use is to screen mirror their phone's or iPad's screen. Then you open a web browser on this device, that then is shared into the Apple TV. It is unfortunate, but sadly, that is indeed the answer. The purpose of this video is not to spread misinformation, but to let people be aware about the limitations of using web browsers on the Apple TV and how it does not have a built-in web browser. If this video cleared up any questions that you had, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.